There are a lot of extremely good Python courses around now, and many of them are free. And, you know, you have to be careful when you use superlatives like the best, because it's often a subjective uh, opinion about whether something is the best or not. Now, it's a word I do use from time to time when I describe courses. And the course that I want to tell you about today, I think could be described as one of the best free Python courses available. But of course, it depends what you need. This is the CS50 course from Harvard. It's a really well known course and you might already know about it. But if you're new to learning how to code and learning about Python, then there's a chance that you won't know about it. So I want to make sure that, you know, if you see this, then you're aware of it because I wouldn't want you to miss out on this course because I think it is so good. Uh, it's from Harvard. It's a very famous course. They have their own YouTube channel. It has over a million subscribers uh, and they have various other courses as well. So once, once you've done the main Python course, uh, you can do a course on web development and there's one on AI as well. Uh, let me show you the course and show you what it contains uh, and then you can decide for yourself. But I think if you're new to Python, and you want to learn not just Python, but the fundamentals of computer science as well, then this would be a good course for you. It's a challenging course. I've taken it myself a few years ago now, but it's, it's, it's not a doddle. Uh, and you learn concepts about computer science that, you know, if you're completely new to the subject, will make you think and uh, will, you know, the, the assignments, which are graded, will take you a while to complete, but it'll give you an excellent foundation. So let's have a look and uh, I can just take you through what this course contains. I'm not quite sure how, but I seem to be inside an old operating system. Hmm. Anyway, if you click on the link in the description, you can come and take a look too. Why would you want to do that? Well, by doing so, you can enter Break the Code 2022 where you'll face a series of challenges and puzzles. And if you solve them, you can win some prizes. You could win an exclusive Keanu Reeves signed script of the Matrix, a James Bond GoldenEye weapon system, a custom MacBook Pro, and the top prize for the best code breaker is a customized setup with the latest equipment worth $12,000. I've already entered the game and I've solved the first puzzle. They're not easy, and I'm a bit stuck on Puzzle 2. Now, the game comprises of four drives, so when you get into this operating system, you have access, first of all, to an email. You have to read that email, and then from that email, you have to work out how to progress onto the next stage. Once you've done that, you have access to the drives where you'll find the more difficult puzzles. A lot of thought's gone into this Break the Code 2022 by .tech domains. Just using the emulator is a lot of fun and the puzzles are challenging. You won't just be able to solve them straight away. I think you'll really enjoy doing it and there's the chance of winning some prizes. So why don't you just click on the link in the description and see what you think. Maybe, just maybe, you can solve all the puzzles. So here it is. This is the information page about the course on the Harvard website. Uh, the course is provided through edX, but it's a free course. I think you can pay for a certificate, but it's a free course. Um, and you can learn a little bit more about it here. It's 11 weeks long with a time commitment of 10 to 20 hours a week. So it's, you know, it's a serious course. And this is what you'll learn. Uh, you, it's an entry level course taught by David J. Malin. David Malin is a great teacher. He really is. Uh, and he teaches these subjects very, very well. And he explains the concepts very well. So what it covers is abstraction, algorithms, data structures, encapsulation, resource management, security, software engineering, and web development. Languages include C, Python, SQL, and JavaScript, plus CSS and HTML. And there are problem sets as well. So it's not just here's how to code in Python. It's much more of uh, a, a, an all round course that teaches you the fundamentals of computer science and then teaches how to apply some of those uh, in Python. Uh, I think you'll really like it. If you haven't heard of the course before, then go and take a look. It's free. So before you spend any money on another course, just go and have a look at this one. If you go to YouTube uh, and search for CS50, you'll see this page here. And you'll be able to get an idea of the style and whether it's for you or not. Um, 
I can't see how it wouldn't be. Uh, it's, it's such a good course. I think most people would learn well from this course. So go and take a look before you spend any money on another course. Go and take a look at this course and see what you think. I hope that's been of use for you and I'll see you next time. I almost forgot to say, the link is in the description, but you know, you probably guessed that anyway. <laughs>